Hey guys, real quick, I just want to go through some tests to see if this golf cart is going to run. I picked it up uh, without any keys, without any batteries. First thing you got to do, jack the back wheels up off the ground so that they don't, your cart doesn't take off on you. Go to your Curtis controller. It's got three wires up here. One, two, three. These two go to your potentiometer, which is your gas pedal, basically. And so hook a couple of alligator clips to those. You can see here I've got one alligator clip on each one of those. And take the other end of your alligator clip and put it onto your multimeter leads. Check your multimeter. And uh, when you press the gas pedal, you should get a variant of resistance that changes. Okay. That's showing that your potentiometer or gas pedal is actually working. Go ahead and remove those leads. The next thing is your solenoid. Okay, you've got your, your main power of your full pack voltage going into one side of the solenoid. This is your solenoid down here. This big wire is the whole 48 volts positive side going into the side of your solenoid here okay the other side of the solenoid comes up and goes to this bolt right here so let's just go ahead and bypass the solenoid by putting one alligator clip on that bolt and the other alligator clip on the hot side of the solenoid or you can just go up here to the positive terminal and tap it to make sure it doesn't cause a big reaction and it's okay so now that's charged or on next we want to power on the Curtis controller this last and third one is the power on we'll connect a alligator to that and we should be able to take it straight over to this positive lead right here and it's not sparking go ahead and put that on there next thing should be able to press the gas pedal and the cart would move uh, but it's not so we may have problems I don't know there it goes I put it in reverse press the gas pedal and it's going in reverse look at that how we uh, let's try forward okay and it's working it's going forward look at that that's how you hot wire an electric golf cart with a Curtis controller and test your controller test your motor all that stuff works thanks for watching guys I look forward to getting this uh, this is a Western Elegante Limo. It's a pretty rare golf cart. It's actually an easy go. Well, all the running gear is pretty much easy go and then the uh, Western goes and they do their own body on it um, back in from the mid 80s to the early 2000s.